Hello, so this video is going to be about uh, Boleskine House, which I just ran across today for some odd reason, but I'm being pulled into one distinct area, one of the bedrooms. I don't know whose bedroom it was. I don't really know anything about this. I know it was Aleister Crowley's property. But there's one bedroom. It won't even let me look at the rest of the house. There's one room that they want. That wants to be focused on. But that's not where I'm getting pulled. So, let's see. What's up with this room? Empty. 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 Okay. What's up with this room? Go hmm. wild, Vince Adams. Give me a quote, please. What's up with this room? What's up with this room? Quote, please. For this room. Okay. It says, if only he laughed more. Vens. What kind of name is that? Let's see. <coughs> Excuse me. Dutch. Then means swamp or bog. Okay. Go wild, empty, and if only he laughed more. Alright. So. Uh, I gotta get back to where I was. Um, I don't know why Jimmy Page was there. I mean, I literally just ran into something about Alistair Crowley and led me to this house, and then I saw a couple of things about Jimmy Page being there. I don't know if he was filming an album there. Uh, okay. Boleskin. I just want them to pronounce it. And my nose is probably going to start running. And yet they just said something about it. Um, what did I just hit? It is notable for having been the home of Alistair Crowley. Oh, Jimmy Page owned it at one time. Okay. Okay. Swamp or Bog. 1970 to 1992. Wow. Owned it for a while. Okay, let's see. Tell me about this one room that I'm seeing. Rogue. Hmm. Rogue. Oh. Huh. All right, I think. So let me show you the room that I'm seeing. not letting up. It's 
So it's this back one, the one furthest in the back. The one that they keep showing is that one with the um, archway, but that back one is speaking to me. Uh, Rogue, so it's a fake room, it's an empty room, it's because I'm wondering where he was performing his um, rituals. But that room's calling me. Alright. Let me see what that is. What, what do I need to know about this room? Rogue. Anyone for whom money is important? Those who believe money is the key to their success. Um, is this the king? King of King of Pentacles. Anyone for whom money is important. Those who believe money is the key to their success. Okay, let's see what's going on here. The last skin house. This back bedroom. I don't know. I think it's a fake. Or that might be where he was doing his rituals. Maybe they just answered me and I wasn't really listening. What do I need to know about this back room? The lovers. Oh. Okay. Uh, here we go. Phew! <laughs> okay, hold up. Let me go here, too. Tell me about this back room. Okay. Three and three. Three and three. One. And three. Tell me about this back room. Oh, I don't like that. Child, kindergarten, sexual abuse, monster under the bed, toys, pregnant, parenting, orphan, homework, schoolyard bully, forced to home, naive, abortion, child support, and absent father. Tell me about this back room. There's something about... Oh, I didn't even go here. Okay. All right, it's starting. I don't know if this is. Okay, I'm getting boats. I'm getting boat, ship, dock, port. I'm getting uh, cruise. I'm getting. Taken, trafficked, traffic, trafficked, trafficked, trafficked. Um, arriving my ship though. That's what I'm getting. I don't know if there's a dock here. Okay, music group. Let me turn that over because I don't really love looking at that. Uh. Wedding band, record deal, songwriter, screaming fans, piano class, live act, fandom, autograph, notation, studio, loudspeakers, arena, singer, virtuoso, recording, and on tour. Um, I'm getting, because it did say, when I looked at the blueprints of this, it said there's four back rooms two on each side and it said camera 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 I don't know if that's what they called bedrooms back in the day but that's kind of weird so was something being recorded in that room oh and there is I did see a picture with the piano okay let's see what's going on here uh, Leskin house 
so we have the lovers. Wait, what did that say? Swamp or bog? Where did I get that from? Vens. Seven of Swords. Anxiety or delays in plans. What is this? There's another waterway here. There's water here. Water here. Seven of Swords in reverse. Seven of Swords in reverse. I'm diagnosing you with imposter syndrome. Trust me, I'm a doctor. Hashtag insecurity. The lovers and then the Seven of Swords in reverse. Okay. What do I need to know about this room? Two of Wands. Reflection. Is that where the mirrors were? More water. Hmm. Kidnapping kids. Kidnapping kids. Uh, five of Swords. The Sweet Holy One. I don't love that. There's two things that, um, what's this? The Moon Secrets. More water. Okay. It said something about... So, there's a sun there, moon there, crescent moon here. Trying to get in touch with somebody's mother. Mother? Mm -hmm. I don't know if there was births being given in this room. Okay, there's two things that they said that stood out to me. Uh, I'll attach the segment that I haven't even finished watching. I watched the first like five minutes and I'm like, I need to do a reading on this. What's going on here? Um, one about him. So one thing, three things. Ritual masturbation. Something about drinking the blood of children. I don't know. I have to further watch it to see what that was about. And then mother. What was the other thing? Oh. He was charged with sodomy, rape, or abuse. So mommy issues, probably dressed up. Okay, I'm getting this is him. This is like him getting in touch with this I had another moon this is a full moon ritual room or a moon a moon room but this is him getting in touch with his either his feminine and masculine within himself or getting in touch with or, hmm, hold on. Let me see first. Let me see. Um, there's a crow there. There's a lot of interesting water features here. So, I, does that room lead to the water that's behind the house? Kind of like Epstein's Island. I think there was a pathway where boats were coming in. Actually, I think it was submarines. And there was a way to get to that temple. I think they were going to the temple without being detected by other people on the property. That's what I'm getting. Alright, there's going to be some kind of triangle configuration here too for him to be practicing whatever he's practicing in this house so I'd like to know where do the other two coordinates point to alright let's 
Let me go further. Can I get one of these? What do I need to know about this room? What do I need to know? What are you trying to tell me about this room? Shark. More water. Okay. Shark. Aggressive, danger, and warning. Um, okay, yes, because I'm getting that too. I'm getting a Long Island serial killer kind of vibe, but within the first five minutes of the segment that I'm going to attach, he buys the house, moves in, calls the cops, and he says something like, something about conspicuous and prostitutes in the same sentence. I can't recall exactly what he said, but the cops go out and they look around and they call him back and they said, we didn't see anything. And he said, no, dummies, there are no prostitutes. That's the problem. Hmm. Um, okay. It's feeling like, uh, how do I say this? So I think the room that I'm looking at was a storeroom for either mothers, children. There's something about being able to go underneath. There was something else. Mother's children. Um, oh, what it kind of feels like is uh, I can get one of those. Um, it feels like a sleeve port or like a traffic and station where the person gets dropped off at this property and also picked up by someone different at this property. Okay, I'm going to keep going. The Leskin House. Uh, it's telling me to get one of these and I will. Okay, right here. The Leskin House. What do I need to know? Look at this. More water. So this is in Scotland? Um, ma'am, Kumba Bang, speak up. Sorry for mispronouncing that. Water, 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 water. Alright, let's see what this says. Goddess of Speaking Up, Senegal. Temple Griots, Element Water. Man Kumba Bang protects the mouth of the Senegal River. When making an offering to her, you must not speak to anyone else coming or going. Sing for her. Music group. Chant for her. Call to her. Give Goddess Kumba your voice and she'll be happy. Uh, it says, speak up, speak out, speak on it, you have a right to be heard. The embodiment of the card. You are betraying yourself by not speaking up. Your words have power, own your voice. Okay, I guess that would make... Oh, that's so interesting. I'm glad I said that out loud. So if Jimmy Page owned it after was Crowley getting it ready as far as increasing the electric energy or the power of it. Oh, I don't know what I'm trying to say, but I do. All right, let's see. You are betraying yourself. Okay, so then we have to go back to, sorry, because this is bringing me back to, all right. 
what record, if any, was written or recorded here. And if there was, how did that affect our lives? All right, let me keep going. You are betraying yourself by not speaking up. Your words have power on your voice. As the old saying goes, stand up for something or fall for anything. Being neutral is not an option. When you stand firmly in your truth, you have thoughts, opinions, beliefs, and convictions. What do you stand for? Tell someone today. And the mantra is, I reclaim my voice. I speak out and speak up. And I, I speak out and speak up. Interesting. Oh, maybe they were having, maybe this place was having slaves go through there in one way or another. Child, I don't, I don't want to. Okay, let me go further. Let me clarify and I feel like I want one of these. I do. Okay. Tell me about this room. What was going on in this room? Jump bar. I was hoping I'd get one. Okay. Revelation. Okay. There's an onk there. There's a snake. Temptation. He's shushing somebody. Pillars like the high priestess. Ugh. What's Revelation? What's the revelation? Can I go here? Oh, I'm gonna have to. I don't have to, but revelation. What's the revelation? Right here. Oh, oh, oh. How many children? Two, one, two, four, six. Oh. Okay, sorry to bring a light deck into this, but sometimes that does help. Okay, Revelation, how many children? Oh God, okay. Uh, 59. 14, 5, 2, 5, vigils. All night vigils. Then, I feel like I had something else, what was this? 33, two sixes, irritation, uh, 59, revelation, revelation as an act of unveiling the hidden, symbolizes the human virtue of making intelligible that which was unintelligible. It is associated to the planet Mercury. So here we go with more talking, singing, shushing, money, mothers, children, choices, speaking up. The letter D in the number five, it represents the principle of manifestation. Transcendental, uh, so as an element of prediction, no, sorry, the quote is, Quote is, as the metals are tested in the fire, likewise the value of a man is tested in the mouth of who praises or censors him. I don't really see any fire. Um, as an element of prediction, it promises declarations, authorizations, messages, messengers, contradictory news, voyages, adversity, loquacity, did I say that right? Loquacity? Violation of secrets. Loquacity is a quality of talking a great deal, talkativeness. So somebody was over talking or under talking. Okay. 
clarifiers and stickers and I'm out. Why the lovers? Why the lovers? I'll go here. Why the lovers? Four swords. A dark haired woman. Piano. I said that could be the room where the piano was. Uh, making a choice between women, men, women, children, slave free, captured free. I don't know what the choice is. We got more music though. So do they have like an official person just playing music? I feel like the music or whatever sound, okay, that was going on in this room was to either brainwash or cause, cause hysteria or mindfuckery or something. Alright, let's see. Four swords. So either secluded or separated from someone. Okay, let's see. Four swords here. Community. Lovers. Oh, ooh, okay. Is this like a hookup room where people can come and community. Let me keep going. Alright, give me one of these. Why two of wands? Why the two of wands for this room in particular? Trust. So luring them in. Okay, yeah. She tied? Yeah. Yeah. Luring them in and then... Two of Wands, Trust. Luring them in and then... <coughs> Excuse me. Bonding them? <coughs> uh. Hold on. <coughs> Luring them in. And then restraining them, secluding them. It's not bonding. Um, kind of like she's tied up. So, oh. uh, 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 luring them in and then holding them hostage is what I'm getting. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. Um, Seven of Swords in Reverse. What was that again? Seven of Swords in Reverse. Insecurity. Um, what's this about? Seven of Swords in Reverse. Ten of Wands. Wow. Wow. I know if this is kind of telling me fuck. Oh god. Um especially with that snake there. Revelation tempt okay. This might have been when all this began. Uh this is like a playbook. So Somebody taught, somebody taught, there's some kind of knowledge or book out there that lets people know how to attract, seduce, groom, call in, and then, uh, what is this, bait and switch? 
yeah, kind of like a bait and switch thing. So I'm going to tell you how to start it off in the beginning so they trust you and they come to you, but then when they come to you, yeah. Okay. Give me my the Five of Swords here. Let's go here. My the Five of Swords. King of Wands. So I don't know if let's see. Is that a dragon? Something going on there. I don't know if Moon and he's holding a Moon Staff, King of Wands, Mother Issues. He was a Scorpio, so this I mean, it could be him. I don't know if the police were aware of what was going on here. Why am I getting that kind of? Somebody else says, man, another man did it. it uh... Is this the beginning of police corruption? The police turning their back? The police being involved? Possibly, I wish he would laugh more. Empty, and what was the other thing? Go wild, Benz. All right, the moon. This should be interesting. Let me go with a darker card. Why the moon? Why the moon? Uh, actually, let me go with one of these. Why the moon? Oof, oof. High Priestess, wow. Okay. What year is this? What the heck were they? I don't know if this is the beginning of snuff films, the beginning of recording things quickly. I'll show that. Uh, the moon. So now I've got a nun. Secrets. The police. Religion. Here we go. This is the beginning. This is the beginning. That's why I'm here. Um, this is likened to politicians using Alinsky's playbook. So these people are using Crowley's playbook, allegedly speculation only, of how to do this thing that they do. Okay, I gotta... Okay. Let me just keep going. Um... Let's go stickers. Okay, let me pull his picture up. Now I'll stay with the room. Tell me. He's about. Is that two? That's two. Huh. Huh. So a medical box and then. Illinois 1818 a red cardinal that to me signifies that to me is my sign for mother uh, 1818 when did he own this house when did he own this house Home of eighteen ninety nine to nineteen thirty. What was it built? So the house was constructed in the 1760s by Colonel Archibald Frazier as a hunting lodge. That's the other thing. Here we go with Hunger Games shit. This stuff has been going on for a while. Two of Wands, Hangman. 
Valeskin House. Two of Wands, Hangman, please. This is two. It is. What's this? Brazil, uh, kind of like. Screw religion. Wow. Look at that. We follow a dark master here. Hmm. So this has been going on for a long time. And then a French newspaper. Newspaper. Uh, Archibald Fraser. What was, what is that? What was Alistair Crowley's famous saying? Do what thou wilt shall be the whole of the war. The joy of life consists in the exercise of one's energies, continual growth and constant change, the enjoyment of every new experience. To stop means simply to die. The eternal mistake of mankind is set up an attainable ideal. What am I trying to find out? Uh, I want to know about these Fraser people that started a hunting lodge in 1760. Archibald Fraser has a hunting lodge. Served as a British consul in Tripoli and Algiers. And would serve as MP for Inverness, Shire, and Parliament. The house was commissioned by Archibald Campbell Fraser, 1736, 18 Illinois. 18. Uh, Fraser's expanded the hunting. Let's see. I want to see what this is first. It said that Archibald also chose a site on purpose as a means of winding up. Simon, a political rival, because of his support of the Hanoverians and the Jacobite, Jacobite, Rising. Over the following decades, the Frasers expanded the hunting lodge into something resembling the house it is today. Okay, yes, okay, hold on. It says, in his partial autobiography, The Confessions <coughs> of Alistair Crawley, he explained how he would conduct his magic, saying that the first essential is a house in a more or less secluded situation. There should be a door opening to the north from the room in which you make your oratory. Okay, outside this door you construct a terrace covered with fine river sand. This ends in a lodge where the spirits may conjugate. conjugate. The story goes over that the ritual took over six months to prepare for, including celibacy and abstinence from alcohol. Two things Crawley famously loved. I don't know if I want to be reading all this. Oh, what is this? He was summoned to Paris by the Grand Master of the Golden Dawn, a secret society. Um, don't know, no, 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 no. Crowley's housekeeper. Okay, what does this say? One of the most chilling moments of the house's life, Crowley's housekeeper, Hugh, suffered several immense tragedies, including the death of two children. 
which led Crowley admitting that his black magic experiments had gotten out of hand. Somebody committed suicide in Crowley's bedroom with a shotgun in 65. Okay. What the? Alright, let me see if it says anything about him recording. He thought it would be a great environment to write songs, but as is the case for someone of his standing, after he organized for it to be restored, he spent little to no time there and left it in the care of his friend. Huh. Okay. Let me keep going. I want to see if it tells me about this back bedroom. Alright, let's see. Seven of Swords in reverse with the Ten of Wands. Valeski. Valeski? Valeski. Hmm. What's this say? You've seen horrible things, an army of nightmare creatures. Ah, uh, and Taurus. What is the Five of Swords with the King of Wands? Alaska. Five of Swords, King of Wands. Five of Swords, King of Wands. Hit in the head and the shore. Something about the shore. Line. Hairline. Fracture. Shore. The sweet holy one. Big wave. I, I want to get out of here though. Uh, the moon with the high priestess. What is this about? The moon with the high priestess. What is this about? And I want to get two of these stickers for that one. So travel? Astral travel? Uh, dimension travel? Interesting. Another snake. Look at, they all have books. Knowledge. That's what that room's about. Okay. Um, where are these stickers? Give me two of these. Two of these stickers for what's going on in this room. What was going on? Let me pull the picture up before I pull the stickers. What was going on in this room? What's going on in this room? Where's the picture? Right there. Can you tell me what was going on in this room? Please? Okay. Let's say. Drought of living death. Swamp, bog, wave, drought. Drought there. Mmm. Draining souls. Something like draining souls. Draining prana. Draining life force. Witches brew. Witch. Watered stark unctions. 1586. And. What's this? Spider silk since 1994. Oh, it makes sense. Hold on. Sp 
spider silk. So spinning a web, weaving. What does this say? One hundred percent pure. Spider. Spider. Silk. Huh. A new world, a new way of living, a new, trying to uh, invent something new, a new way of Let's say since 1994. Maybe the spell broke in 1994. 100% pure virgins? How is that possible? Huh? Canum something. I can't see this thing. Um, need make spell work silky something. Bind your enemies. Arcanum craft. Mm. Okay, I'm out of here. Thank you.